Okay, everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can fix the issue when contact name on contacts are not showing to you. Now, there are plenty of different things what could have happened. The first one is this right here. So you might have received a text message, but it just tells you that it's for messages. You might see the icon and whatnot, but you cannot even see the name of the person texting you, which might be kind of annoying. To fix this, just leave the app like this, go to the uh, settings, and navigate to the notification section. So tap on notifications and scroll down and find the messages right here. The list is sorted alphabetically, so it is how it is. So you just get in here and the option I want to, I want you to see and just get in touch with is the one called show previews. Now the name and the, um, kind of preview of what's inside of the text message is something that you perhaps want to see in this case. So when you click on it, you want to show, uh, you want to make sure that it gets shown to you either always or when unlocked. Because in the case which I showed you before in the photo where you don't see anything, it was probably set to never. And this is what you probably have as well. When this is the case, I would recommend you to set it when unlocked, which is the default option for me. It means that when your phone is laying on a table, it's locked, you don't even have it with you. People just cannot tap the screen and read the messages or read the contact telling you or showing, contacting you or whatnot. But when you scan your face, when you unlock it with Face ID or Touch ID, then you will be able to see the preview and the person texting you. So this is what I would keep turned on. But yeah, that is one of the one of the things which uh, you may be referring to. However, there is an, also another option which you don't have as much control over, and that is when somebody is calling you, perhaps, but they have the hide number option enabled. So if you come back to the settings again, I mean, you cannot really do much with it, but I'm going to show it to you at least how it works. So if you go to the phone app, um, you can actually click on show my caller ID and it depends on which like SIM card you have, but you can enable it and disable it uh, based on how you want. So for example, you might disable show my caller ID. The other person actually who is calling you might have this feature turned off and that way when they call you, you cannot see their name. You don't know who is calling you because they have like a private phone number. So in this case, you cannot do much with it. The only, only the other side can change it, but at least you should know that this is the option as well. And besides that, there are also like different things which you um, could be played with, could, could be going on, like perhaps you don't have your contacts synced, you perhaps see the phone number texting or calling you, but you don't have the contacts synced. So what you can do is also just um, click on and like reset at the contacts. Uh, so if you tap on your name at the top, you can go to iCloud and click on the um, show all, tap on uh, contacts and turn it off, then turn it back on to like reload all, all of your contacts to get them back in. So perhaps this is the problem because obviously I don't have your phone in your in my hand, so I don't know what's what's really happening. But yeah, these are all of the options which um, could be uh, the issue. So, uh, if you found this video helpful, make sure to leave a thumbs up, subscribe down below, but don't forget to also check out uh, the Fox tech educational platform, which is free to access for anyone. The link is going to be down below in uh, the description. So yeah, make sure to, to find it there, join it. There are many courses for you to watch. So go ahead and do it right now. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll catch you guys later in uh, the future video.